Hey everyone, what's going on? Ben, your agent with eXp Realty with another episode of your weekly market update. This week, we're going to talk about Orange County, my favorite area where the beaches are. So nice. So right behind me, as you guys, first time, if you're here, please do me a favor. I do weekly market updates along with some buyer seller tips and some just great information for my channel. Please hit that like and that subscribe to follow me with the notification bell. So let's get started. We're gonna talk about Orange County, like I said. Um, this is InfoSparks, the real data coming from the multiple listing service. So a couple things that we wanna go over for the sellers and the buyers to know how you can be effective in this market. Let's start with sales price. So let me change that to one year to make it easier to read. So in 2003, January, we were at 1.285378 million. Now it has increased to 8.9% um, as of last month. So, <clears throat> you know, it, it's been growing steadily. Um, we see that since last year in October of 2022, let's give you another idea. It was at 1,229,212. This year it's at 1,407,950. And from the data and from other people that I listen to that are economic forecast people in the National Association of Realtor all tell me that we don't see prices going down anytime soon. Inflation continues to push home prices up because there is low inventory. So buyers, take advantage of it now. Sellers, this is good for you because you can sell your house at a good, um, you know, at a good price for your equity. All right, let's go to new listings. How many new listings? So last month, we saw 2,121, um, September 1,868. Uh, so there was a decrease, it looks like a decrease from September to August of 17.6%. <clears throat> if we go in the beginning of the year, January 2023, it was 1,705. So increase since the beginning of this year. And then October of last year, it was 1,944, so a little down from last year. New listing, um, it has been an average of um, the next one, month supply has been an average is 1.9% average of homes supply on market. So um, it's been an uh, increase. Um, we see this increase up here since January of 2022, where it was a 0 0.9, 0 0.9 month supply, not even a month of supply. So now we're at 1.9, which is really good news. Uh, January 2023 was at 1.8. So what a significant jump from January 2022, where it was 0.9 to January 2023, 1.8. And then now this month, uh, last month, 1.9. What a huge difference, guys. And if, 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 if <clears throat> the interest rates do go down, um, which we don't see happening till maybe second quarter of 2024, um, that number will continue to stay like this. We're seeing a stable, stable like, you know, this year, it'll maybe stay the same throughout, you know, since the beginning of this year, it's been 1.8, now 1.9, so it'll be the same. Um, if interest rate do go down, we will see a number go higher. So let's hope for, you know, some good news. Um, all right, active listings um, for you buyers out there in Orange County. As of last month, 3,057, um, we see a 40% decrease. Wow. So a 40% decrease. Um, numbers say August says 3,059. September says 3,057. Uh, I don't, that's a negative 40.1 decrease. Uh, January 3,468, that's probably where they're getting the 40% decrease. And then um, October last year was uh, 
4,944 and then January of last year, 2,491. So a decrease I see happening since whew, June of last year, 5,011, and it's been going down ever since. So see the trends do, the facts do make sense when interest rate do continue to go up and up. <clears throat> All right, guys, pending sell. This is information good for sellers to see. Um, as of last month, we're at 1,356 pending sales. What are pending sales been? It's just um, sellers accepting offers. And they're in escrow, pretty much. Closed sales, we see as of last month, 1,651, uh, which is an 18% decrease of last month. And um, January is 1,139. Um, so it's been up since January. That's great. And then October was 1,735. All right, guys. Um, again, days on market, very, very important. How long does it take a house? This is good for you sellers. How long does it take a house to sell, right? So uh, let's start to, to the left. So as of last year, January, it takes about eight days, really quick. And then we see an uptick. <clears throat> where it's 24 days. This is, I see this for the first time right here, actually September, 2022, 20 days. Um, and then, and then, and then October is what last year, it was actually more than the average in, entire MLS, which is the entire California, how it, it took, Orange County took longer than the average, uh, the medium, market days on market for the whole MLS. Then you see an uptick here in January, this beginning of this year, um, <clears throat> took 31 days to sell a home. And then down there, it's like a huge roller coaster, boom, 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 boom. And then last month it took 11, the month before 10. So um, it's selling, people are selling their house pretty fast the last few months since January. So if you're a seller, you know, definitely if you're motivated to sell a house, need to do something with your house. Um, good news. <laughs> um, homes are selling really, really fast at the moment. So this is your market update for Orange County for residential, all property types, attached, detached, um, all type bedrooms, all type bathrooms, um, all price ranges. I like to keep it simple, all square footage, all lot size. So my name is Bennett. And um, if you like this information, please share it out to someone who's looking to buy or sell a home or invest. I do work with in, um, investors. I am, you know, I'm here to help. I'm a new home construction specialist as well. And um, you can get in contact with me easily through this email campaign, or you can um, shoot me a text or a message through my social media at Ben, your agent. Um, please subscribe if you have not subscribed. I appreciate every one of you that subscribed. Thank you so much for watching this video. And I have a whole playlist for the year. You can go into my playlist and see other months as well. Thank you, guys. Have a great October. And I'll see you on the next video. Take care now.